Okay, what's up everybody? So this is my old man and um, just wanted to show you that um, in 45 minutes while I went to go pick up my mom from work, he made this house look really clean. Not only that, but now he's going to step it up further and he's going to make some breakfast. Hi everybody. Peace out. Okay, so now that I gave my dad the recognition he wanted for cleaning the kitchen, I'm going to go ahead and talk to you guys a little bit more about myself today. So I'm going to be telling you guys something that a lot of people don't know about me. Um, not because it's like a big secret or it's too personal. It's more like people never really ask me if I have any sort of mental issues. And if nobody asks me about stuff, then I just don't say anything about it. Okay, so without further ado, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I have a mental condition called Asperger's. For those of you who don't know what that is, or never even heard of that term before, it's basically a form of autism. That's right, I'm a little bit autistic. So my condition affects my ability to socialize and learn things differently than other people. When it comes to learning something new, whether it's a new job or a new video game, it takes me longer than most people to learn something. But once I get the hang of it though, once I get the hang of something new that I learned, then I exceed most people who learned faster than me. Like for example, um, when I first started at my job almost five years ago, back in 2013, um, I was actually one of the worst employees at my job. Um, it took me a while to learn everything about the job compared to everyone else, and uh, people thought I wasn't going to last there very long, and I myself thought I wasn't going to make it at all. But fast forward to today, and I am now one of the best employees there. Well, in my opinion at least. <laughs> so, not only do I struggle to learn stuff like I said, but I also struggle to socialize with people in general. Everybody who knows me, friends, families, acquaintances, strangers, know that I'm a pretty quiet guy to be around, but it's not because I'm shy. It's because my mental condition affects my communication skills. I lack the social skills to um, keep a conversation going, to banter, to, you know, just bullshit around. Um, I don't talk very much, but when I do talk, it's more like it feels like an interview because all I really do is just ask questions and like, hi, how are you? What's new? And that's about it, you know. Okay, I gotta go. We'll see you later. So, everybody who knows me, if you've ever wondered why I'm a really quiet person, now you know why. It's because I just struggle to keep a conversation going, to contribute to the group chat in person, you know. So, pretty much, I'm socially awkward. Um, not by choice, but because I have a mental condition that makes me socially awkward if you want to learn more about my condition just google it and it'll pretty much just tell you what i told you that people with this mental condition are socially awkward the reason i never really tell anyone about this is because um i don't want people to feel sorry for me i don't want people to like for example want to talk to me, be my friend, or the ladies to go on a date with me just because they feel sorry for me, you know. I want to be liked for who I am, so that's why I don't, I've never really said anything about this before. The reason I am now telling everybody about this in this video is because I just want to show everybody that regardless of my learning disabilities, my social skills, it hasn't stopped me from living a great life, you know, like making some good friends, having people who like me and accept me for who I am, even though I've never really told anyone about how I am. Um, it hasn't stopped me from having a great job. 
Um, even though I did, like I said, I did struggle to learn everything about my job compared to everybody else when I started. It hasn't stopped me from maintaining the job and being one of the best to contribute to the company today. So my next plans for my channel is to release videos talking about how I get by in life on a day-to-day -day basis from what I do for a living, what I do on my free time, and by popular request, how do I personally mingle with the ladies? Well, that's it for this video, folks. Now you know a little bit more about me. I want to end this video by giving everybody a shout out who's been in my life. Um, whether you've been in my life for a long time or we just met, I want to give you all a shout out. So yeah, stay tuned for more video vlogs. And as always, until next time.